hey, this is John 5, and um, this is my prototype to my John 5 Telecaster. And uh, Richard McDonald, Mike Eldred, Red Dave, Chris Fleming, and myself, we all kind of got together and talked about, um, you know, what a great all-around telly could be playing really heavy music and then also jazz or country. And um, this is, you know, pretty much the Frankenstein of it. And uh, we took a regular telly and uh, put a super distortion, put a twisted telly, and put a toggle switch in to do, you know, the um, on-off switching. Rosewood neck. Now this is before the uh, we put the regular John 5 um, headstock on there. The headstock is a lot larger and it has three and three, like a Les Paul. But the there's the um, shaved part of the headstock here for the behind the nut bends. But um, you know this one has the humbucker and it's it sounds great. I mean I still use my prototype for a lot of the live gigs and stuff because they're you know they're just built great and I think it's pretty much Fender builds the best guitars in the world for real. Um, the other model has a Bigsby, has a hot rail, so it's a, a different pickup. And um, But the Bigsby is very cool because you can pretty much rock on it pretty good without it going out of tune. But uh, that's the difference between the two Telecasters. And if you want to just you know, play something like this. Yeah. Um, John, let's... before you get to that, um, the, the switching, I know the top, are those, are those two different volume controls? Um, yes. Oh, so there's no tone control? No, there's no tone control. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, there's um, two separate volume controls. There's no tone control. I mean, you don't really need it with the Telecaster with the the wood they use and all that stuff. Um, because of the fact, I like to do the on-off switching, like that. You know, the, the um, so it's it's kind of cool, you know, and you could do some crazy stuff on it, but. I always thought that the when I bought a Telecaster, old vintage ones, they just sound so good anyways with you know the wood and how they put them together back in the day and you know this one is pretty much like that. It's a great piece of wood so it sounds awesome anyways. So I don't need a tone control. <laughs> 